Game five, boys. Big game tonight. I took a huge win, game four. How are you feeling for tonight's game? Uh, I feel good, obviously. I'm um, still up three games for one, boys. Game five's gonna be a real hoot. Um, I'm more focused on blood, so the first period is gonna be about coming out hot. So today, it's not necessarily about the win, boys. Uh, obviously, I'll be taking shots whenever I can, but more focused on chopping digis. Uh, maybe a few to the windpipe. And yeah, <laughs> you gotta catch me first. Big hits, boys, big hits. So oh, hit that subscribe button if you want to see more, boys. Jacob's got all his twigs. Hey, my twigs. I got nice. all those twigs. Bunch of weapons. Team Oli or Team Jacob? That's right, boys. So comment, hit that sub button. We need all the help that we can get. It's helping us get through this time, and hopefully it's helping you get through this time. All right, boys. We're going to jump into warmies. <laughs> Again, in a must-win situation, Bob, what are we going to see tonight? <laughs> well, Peter, Jacob last game was strictly out to take off Oli's head. I think he's going to be more focused in tonight's game, try and end the series, or it could be wrong, he could be trying to murder Oli once again in Game 5. Well, Bob, I wouldn't mind seeing blood tonight. <laughs> Let's jump right into it. Game 5 starts now. Chris Mason here, broadcaster for the Nashville Predators, but tonight I will be previewing Game 5 of the epic series between Ole Poston and Jacob Ardown. Ardown leads the series 3-1, to one, backs against the wall for Ole. Ole's got to get back to the basics. He's got to realize every single shift is the biggest shift of the game. Devil is in the details, and for Jacob, you can't rely on what's happened. You're up 3-1, but this game is the hardest game to close out. The series deciding game should be an epic series. Game five tonight, tune in. Let's do this! Game five. Oh. Out off you. What a, what a save. Oh, 
Well, Bob, a quiet first period only gets a quick strike here, and then after that, it was just straight goaltending. That's right, Peter. After that first nip, it was straight goaltending. The boys put on a show. Now let's jump into the second period. Cover, idiot. I said cover. Oh, see what? to a quick start, post, and it fires it off the post, but it didn't go in, and then Jacob with a quick strike to tie the game at once. Start down with a massive save here, a clutch save, and then post, and it will bury a late one here in the second. And then a quick release here by Oli, puts him ahead by one, 3-2, heading into the third period. Yeah, well, my knee actually might be broken. Yeah, you shot my kneecaps too, pal. That was it. No, it wasn't. Okay. It was on the line. Fine. This is the goalie performance of the decade. Ah! Oh! No goal. 
set. You did see it. Four, two. Performance of the year. Oh, oh my God! What a save! Back to my big time back. That was it. No way, that was close. That, that was, was close. That was close. Carnes. Fine. You're 6 2, I'm destroying you. I'll give it to you. Take it away. What a move. What a save. That's it tonight. Ole Posen and takes game five in an absolute barn burner. It is going to be an amazing game six. Bob, how do you feel? Well, I feel pretty good here. It was a great game. Ole struck quick and did not let go of pressure, and Jacob could not handle him. That's it for tonight.